Greetings, LVA families. I'm Jane Zielinski, your principal here at LVA. Welcome. I'd like to take this opportunity today to share a few of the exciting things that are happening here in our school. Laura B. Anderson is a school-wide Title I school. We currently educate and prepare over 400 students to be successful in a changing world. We have two blended early childhood classrooms. These two early childhood classrooms have a morning and afternoon class, Monday through Thursday. These classrooms are funded by special education, Title I, or Head Start. Our early childhood program serves students ages three through five. Currently, we have 65 early childhood students enrolled at LBA. The Sioux Falls School District has chosen the high school curriculum for all early childhood classrooms and instruction is centered on student choice and exploration. In addition to our 65 three through five year olds, Laura B. Anderson has 350 kindergarten through fifth grade students. Currently, we have three kindergarten classrooms, four first grade classrooms, three second grade classrooms, two third grade classrooms, three fourth grade classrooms, and two fifth grade classrooms. Being a Title I building allows us to offer class size reduction in first grade. We make every attempt to keep these classrooms between 18 to 20 students. In addition to programs funded by Title I, Laura B. Anderson also provides direct instruction to our English language learners. LBA is a center-based ELL site. Students within the Sioux Falls School District who are new to the United States and do not speak English oftentimes start at our elementary immersion center located at Jane Addams Elementary. Once students have found success at the EIC, students transition to a center-based ELL school building based on their home address. Currently, LBA has approximately 100 students identified as English language learners, and we have two teachers that serve these students based on need for 30 minutes of continued reading and language arts instruction. In addition to our ELL teaching staff and staff at LBA, our English language learners and their families are fortunate to have the opportunity to work with our homeschool liaison. Our homeschool liaison works hard to make initial contact with our families and to ensure a high level of communication between home and school. In order to best meet the reading needs of our students, Laura B. Anderson currently has 1.4 Literacy in Action teachers. These teachers focus their instruction on students in grades K through 3 who are reading below grade level. They meet with their students to deliver an additional 20 to 30 minutes of reading instruction within the classroom. Finally, our school social worker is one more resource which enhances our communication with the families of LBA. Our social worker assists with any attendance and truancy concerns throughout the school year. She also assists with our school's communication with various agency programs that may be working with our families. The State of South Dakota and the Sioux Falls School District have adopted and implemented the Common Core Standards in both English Language Arts and Mathematics. The Sioux Falls School District has adopted and implemented curriculum published by Houghton Mifflin in order to support teachers with meeting the standards in English language arts. The curriculum is also supported by shared and guided reading texts found within our classroom libraries and school-wide book room. In addition, the district is in its third year of implementing the Investigations Mathematics curriculum. This program emphasizes students' understanding of the eight standards of mathematical practice as printed within the Common Core State Standards. In all subject areas, students are informally assessed throughout the school year. Teachers are continuously monitoring student achievement through individual conferences, informal observations, and formative assessments that help to guide their instruction. As parents, you are welcome to access your students' grades through Infinite Campus. Teachers are updating this information on a regular basis. Teachers formally meet with parents twice a year at conferences to discuss student progress. Our report card is sent home at the conclusion of each of the four quarters. Our grading scale is now based on the following rubric. The grading scale for 2014-15, a four, is proficient with distinction. By receiving a four, a student has demonstrated going beyond the grade level performance indicators for this quarter by making inferences and by applying the information in new ways that were not explicitly taught. A three is proficient. By receiving a three, a student has demonstrated that he or she meets the grade level performance indicators for this quarter and is on track for attaining mastery of the end of year learning objectives. A two is approaching proficiency. By receiving a 2, a student has demonstrated that he or she is working toward grade level performance indicators for a given quarter and is approaching grade level learning objectives for this quarter. A 1 is below proficient. By receiving a 1, a student has demonstrated that he or she falls below the grade level performance indicators for a given quarter. 
In addition to frequent assessments within the classroom throughout the school year, students in grades three through five will take the online Smarter Balanced assessment near the end of the school year. This will score students' proficiency in both English language arts as well as mathematics. Our fifth grade students will also take the Dakota Step Science. Both the Smarter Balance Assessment as well as the Dakota Step are our state assessments. Based on the above assessments, our school has written the following goals for improvements for the 2014-15 school year. In English Language Arts, by July 1, 2015, 75.9% of LBA 3rd through 5th grade students will be proficient or advanced in the reading as measured by the Smarter Balanced Assessment. In mathematics, by July 1, 2015, 70% of Laura B. Anderson 3rd through 5th graders will be proficient or advanced in math as measured by the Smarter Balanced Assessment. In writing, 70% of our 1st through 5th grade students will score 3 or higher on their 4th quarter report card in the area of writing. Also as a Title I school, Laura B. Anderson participates in the backpack program. Each of our classrooms receives 8 food bags on Thursday. The eight food bags are randomly dispersed amongst the students in each classroom, allowing a different group of students to take the bags home each week. Our school also benefits from the mentoring program through Lutheran Social Services. Forty mentors from various businesses and the community meet with our students on a weekly basis over their lunch hour. Our mentoring program has a waiting list of students wanting a mentor. Oftentimes, this is a highlight of our students' week. The Dental Mobile serves our students each year. The Mobile provides free dental care to our students and attempts to serve as many students as possible within their scheduled amount of time. Several of our parents take advantage of this service from year to year. Fresh Fruits and Vegetables program is offered to our early childhood through fifth grade students. Students are given a fresh fruit or vegetable each day prepared by Hy-Vee. This program teaches our students about healthy eating habits and allows them to be exposed to a variety of fresh fruits and vegetables. This program is funded through a grant offered by the state of South Dakota. All of this would not be possible without the support of you as parents and families. We appreciate your support and willingness to encourage your student to be the best they can be through hard work and effort inside and outside the classroom by reading at home and completing their nightly homework. Your efforts are felt within the classroom and do not go unnoticed. Other ways for you to partner with us as a school is to attend parent breakfasts and parent-teacher student conferences twice a year. Please know you are always welcome to stop by and visit. It is always good to see our families present at Laura B. Anderson Elementary. A current copy of our parent involvement policy can be found in our parent handbook on this district website, or you may certainly request a copy. Again, LBA th families, thank you so much for entrusting your children to us each and every day so that we may live and breathe our mission statement to educate and prepare each student for a changing world, as well as our building mission to interdependently nurture the hearts of children within a learning community driven by high expectations and academic success for all students. Thank you.